Hi, I'm Omkar Arasaratnam. I'm a senior IT security architect with IBM Canada's Security Architecture and Strategy Organization. I'm here to talk to you a little bit about information security as it pertains to the small and medium business. As a security guy, I know security often gets a really bad rep. Security is the thing that prevents you from sending out the email you want. Security is the thing in your organization that prevents you from surfing the website you want. But I'm here to tell you that successful organizations view security as a business enabler. An example of this, uh, which we're all probably familiar with, is in the early 90s when banks started looking at the internet and started getting on the internet. There was a great surge of banks that jumped on the internet quickly. Now, those that did with secure programs allowed them to do so and really gain a lot of market share by younger generation customers that were savvy with the internet and they now have customers for life. Those that chose not to faced an interesting predicament where they were basically caught behind the times and they weren't able to keep up with their competitors. On the other end of the spectrum, those that did without a strong security program ended up failing and they ended up getting a lot of security exposures and even though they say there's no such thing as bad advertising or bad marketing, they ended up getting in the news for a lot of unfavorable things such as being hacked. In this manner, security can really be a business enabler. So if we take our previous example, as you venture forth into new business opportunities and new business areas, if you do so securely, you'll be able to execute with more competence and you'll have better brand recognition and reputation. A successful security program also takes a risk-based approach. What do I mean by risk? Risk is often regarded with a negative connotation as well. But what I mean in this particular instance is the fact that we're not taking a $10,000 solution to solve a $10 problem. Risk is about balancing your risk and reward. And furthermore, it, the S, in the SMB market, it's about making the right buy versus build decision. As an example, a small or medium business customer might choose to partner with a selected security vendor in their security operations center rather than building out their own. Security is about having a holistic approach to things. Security isn't about disparate pieces, be it a firewall, antivirus, proxy, but really an overall risk-based approach to security. Purchasing point technologies without a cohesive roadmap based on capabilities often leads to fragmentation and confusion. We see this a lot with our SMB customers that are trying to quickly buy into the notion of security. The long and short of it is, there's no one product that you can buy in order to make you secure. A successful security program evaluates the risks, determines the best method to addressing the risks, and has a roadmap of attaining these capabilities. If it's a problem that you believe that can be solved with technology, it usually isn't a proper security problem to begin with. Finally, the best offense is a good defense. When we think about security, those of you that are in product development and other industries of this nature will probably be able to relate to the fact that the earlier in a product's life cycle or the earlier on you're able to detect and correct, the less costly of a fix it is. So build security into every part of your organization. Ensure that new business ventures have regular security milestones and checkpoints. And by doing this, you can ensure that you too are secure in all of your new business ventures.